I just love early morning starts on the trail. It's quiet, the birds are out making a bunch of noise and singing, and you get to see wildlife more often early in the morning than you do other times of the day. And it's been a beautiful morning so far on the trail. I've got three goals for this long day hike that I'm on. First is to enjoy some time alone. <laughs> My wife and I just had our third child and over the last 10 days, it's been very busy and bless my wife. She said, go enjoy some alone time. So I'm taking advantage of that. The second goal is to catch a fish. Got my fly rod with me. And the third goal is to visit a lake that I have never seen before. So we're gonna do all three of those things today here in the Uinta Mountains and it's just awesome, awesome to be outside. take a break. It's been about two and a half miles to get to this junction right here. It goes to three different basins and making great time. I've only been on the trail for an hour, so at a two and a half mile an hour pace, which is pretty decent. And uh, time to pull some snacks from the pack and just calorie rich. What am I trying to say? Put some calories in my body. <laughs> Cause I got some big switchbacks for me to tackle and uh, it's starting to warm up for the day. Oh, it's good stuff. Mr. Moose. <laughs> Hello. Please stay right there. So I'm walking on the trail. And I'm talking to the camera, and I look over to my right, and there's a moose. <laughs> this is what I love. Oh man, okay. She has a calf. So we're going to give her some distance here for a minute. Ugh. <laughs> Makes you nervous when you're hiking by yourself like this and you come across stuff like that, but on this trip alone, I've seen two deer, now a moose and her calf. So I'm gonna try to get up ahead of her and we'll we'll go from there. Well that doesn't happen very often. And the nice thing about that is uh, she seemed to be more worried about getting away from me than being protective so uh, that's a uh, that's a benefit there but that doesn't happen very often that you come across a mama and her baby so kind of like took me by surprise thought it was just one and then saw the calf and Ugh! all right be a little bit more on guard but wow it's beautiful I have to show you this. This is amazing. This is absolutely beautiful. That's why I love the Uintas and I love hiking solo. So you get to enjoy things in a different way than when you're with a group. Good day. Well, we got a little bit of rain coming down and cooling things off. I'm maybe three quarters of the way up the switchbacks to get up into this little basin up here. And I'm pooped. <laughs> I feel old and fat. 
my 34 year old body. I know, I know, shouldn't complain, but I feel tired. <sighs> Having a massive type two fun moment where I am not enjoying myself right now. <laughs> and honestly, I'm trying to decide if I just turn around and start walking back that I bite more off than I could chew. And I'm about a mile and a quarter from the lake that I was planning to go to. And I'm like, it's almost noon already. This is steep. I don't know. I'm just having a type two fun moment. And I may just turn around, <laughs> to be honest. I gotta get out of my get out of my head with this kind of stuff. It's been a while since I've been on the trail. And, you know, sometimes you're just not feeling it, even though like 20 minutes ago I was psyched, feeling good, but I don't know. Can't decide what to do. This is what type two fun is like. And for me, I go into a place mentally of like, I just wanna give up, I don't wanna keep going up. And is it worth going all the way to the lake? Am I gonna catch any fish? And should I just go back and get in the car and go fish the meadow that is uh, there more easily accessible and probably catch fish in there? I don't know, but what would you do in situations like this where you're just like almost there, but your motivation is like non-existent? <laughs> what would you do? I gave up. I turned around and it's okay because not every hike has to be epic and amazing and perfect and exactly what you want it to be. So we're gonna head back to the car. I mean I will have done 11 miles by the time I get back to the car so that at least is <laughs> like good cardio, good workout I guess but yeah. Not every hike has to go the way that you exactly plan it. And uh, yeah, it's just how it goes. Well, I think I made the right decision. Mentally, I just feel so much more like calm and at peace and that's what's important right now. So when we get back to the car in another five miles, we're gonna drive down the road just to touch, grab the uh, fly rod out of the pack here, and we're gonna go get some fish. I'll bring you along, don't worry. So I'm actually really glad that I turned around. It's hard for me to convey like in video here how I'm feeling, uh, but I am glad that I turned around because my body is way more fatigued than I think I gave it credit for. And I think if I had pushed all the way to the lake, I might've found myself doing something uh, irrational and just not uh, making smart decisions. So I'm glad that I did what I did because I am beat <laughs> and I want to share this on video because uh, I want to remember it for myself so that I always remember to like think about how I'm feeling on the trail but also like it's not always rainbows and butterflies so we got about two and a half miles back to the car at this point and uh, looking forward to being done hiking today. I've had a good time, but I'm ready to be back to the car. <laughs> well, we are now fishing. And it's very windy.
gonna finish this one out in the car. Uh, thanks for coming along on this hike today, guys. Not what I expected, but that's okay. I, uh, happy to be done and back to the car and let my feet and my joints, everything rest. 11 miles was a bit more than I probably should have done today. <laughs> and I didn't catch fish, so I only accomplished two. No, I accomplished one of the goals and that was to spend time alone which is great so thanks for watching guys if you're not subscribed to the channel please do subscribe hope you have an awesome day catch you on the next one see you later